In this problem, we have to write a unit rate that represents how long it took Jordan to run each kilometer. In the problem, they give some information that it took Jordan 5 hours to run 10 kilometers. So we must use the information 5 hours and 10 kilometers and express that as a unit rate. When writing a unit rate from given information, one thing you can do is to write a fraction bar and make sure you write the units used after the word each for your denominator. In this case, that would be kilometers. Because it is the each unit that you are going to divide by. And in the problem, they give us the information that he ran 10 kilometers. And it took him 5 hours to run the 10 kilometers. After setting up your fraction, you can take that fraction and reduce to lowest terms. And 5 out of 10 would be 1 half. The reduced fraction that you came up with will actually answer the question how long it took Jordan to run each kilometer. We would say that it took him one half of an hour to run one kilometer. So we already established what our unit rate is. Another way to find the unit rate is to take the number 5 and divide it by the number 10. Because we are trying to figure out how far it took him to run for each kilometer, we must divide by the number of kilometers. 10 cannot fit into 5, so we can write a 0 at the top. And 0 times 10 is 0, and 5 take away nothing is 5. And what we can do is say that our answer is 0 and 5 tenths. So we have no whole number here, so we can just take this leftover fraction and reduce that to lowest terms, which would be 1 half. So that's another way of seeing that it took him 1 half of an hour to run 1 kilometer. Or we can take this same division problem and express it as a decimal. 10 cannot fit into 5, so we can place a 0 directly above the 5 and place a decimal here as well as directly above and add a 0 in the tenths place. And 10 can be divided into 50 five times. So we may also express our unit rate by saying that it took Jordan 0 0.5 hours to run one kilometer.